Hello babies, my lovely babies. I'm in a very sexy mood and I decided to channel this energy in a very sexy way. So, okay, let's see how your person, the person you're thinking of, would um, fuck you. <laughs> the kind of fantasies they have with you. First of all, bottom of the deck energy is... Um, um, Seven of Swords, Moon in Aquarius. Now, don't interpret this card as with what I wrote here. This is just something they wouldn't sell you. They would not sell you what they would do to you. They would take you by surprise. And I have the feeling they would tie you up and like mm, blindfold you. And they would do a lot of unusual things. Just a lot of unusual things. I, I have a feeling it's a new sexual thing going on. Like a new relationship or at least a new sexual relationship they're having with you and you stir up their interest and they would do a lot of crazy sexy new stuff with you and they would just try a lot of new things and very crazy unusual things but in a fun way a very fun way at the same time they would respect you they but they would take you they, they would love to take you by surprise with new things as I said, and blindfold you and uh, do those. Uh, and they would love to do unusual things with you. But in a very fun way, in a very light way. Now let's see. Oh my god. <laughs> you get them on. You get them on like crazy. Like I have the feeling that there's no one to turn them on the way you do. <sighs> It's like, oh, they would. <laughs> Maybe this is not going to resonate for all of you. But if you feel this resonating with you, okay, take it. <laughs> you can take it like literally that uh, it, if you know what I mean. <laughs> for, they would take you somewhere dark, <laughs> somewhere hidden. And they would fuck you there. They maybe they even have dreams of like putting you up in a dungeon or something like that, and uh, <laughs> tying you up. And a lot of um, BDSM stuff, or at least BDS stuff. If you don't like BDSM, the SM at the end is for uh, sadism and masochism. But if you don't put that, is BDS. Bond, uh, you know, just Google it up. It's uh, what I'm trying to say here is that sadism and masochism doesn't have to be involved, but the other parts of BDSM may very well do, and they do. Whoa, I love this. <laughs> Hold on, <clears throat> they would love to boast to other people about the way they fuck you, like. Maybe you've... I sense that you have already been intimate with this person at least three times. Or at least most of you have. And this approval from you, this recognition gets gets them going. It's like... Mm, they love... Maybe, maybe for some of... Like... For some of you, your person may have some Leo placements and they love to have um, approval from others and recognition from others and they would love to boast in front of others with the way they fuck you a lot. Now, there's also something else with this energy here, but... Mmm... <laughs> Maybe for some of you, they they would see a future with you, like a future of a family, of a, you know, stuff like that. But they don't want to get so far, like, ahead of, the, of themselves. They, they want to take things as they are, slowly. I heard, you know that song, My Pony? If you want it, let's do it, ride it, My Pony. Ah, they, they, you could... Play that song for them and uh, have some sexy time with them if you want to. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I have this visual of them tying you up. 
like in a very BDSM type of way, like, you know, really tying you up to the point where you can't move yourself anymore. And then at that point, their imagination just gives them one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, at least seven options of what they would like to do to you at that point. And like, they can't decide. They just, it's like, it's as if they, for a moment, they would just stay there and if they're a guy, just, you know, just wank it in front of you until they decide what to do to you. <laughs> like, it's just the thought of you gets them going. This is so fun. I love this energy. Wow. Oh, they would also love to see you as... Um, like you dominating them at the same time. <laughs> they would love to see you doing that, you know, like with some leather and uh, all that stuff. And, and um, yeah, they would love to see you dominating them a lot. <laughs> but it's like when you interact, so this is what's going on through their head, a lot of stuff, but when you interact, they have this thing of holding it back a little, because they don't want to scare you, they don't want to surprise you in a way that would not surprise you, like, they don't want to surprise you in a bad way, so they very much think of, of what to do, how to do it, and they just want to think, take things slowly time by time almost as like trying you out and seeing <laughs> like they would definitely explode in a lot of unusual ways <laughs> you can take this as it resonates yes but they would definitely try a lot of things just all at once but in terms of the manifest like this is their fantasies when they think of you, they everything goes on in their head. But when when they're with you, they take it slowly. <laughs> it's it it's what I said. What I sense they they want to cooperate with you, and it's like they even want to talk to you about the things they fantasize about and they may think that mm, maybe this is too much or maybe this is like they, they wouldn't want to do things that you would not agree with and that's why they, they would love to have conversations with you where you where you talk things out and 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 see what you like how you like and all that stuff so to be able to please you more, please themselves as well, but to be able to please you, they would love to please you. And it'd be well if you tell them like everything, everything that goes on in your mind and the way you love to be pleased and all of that, all of that stuff. And uh, they admire you a lot and they take a lot of time for themselves to just think about you and kind of analyze you, not only in a sexual way, so this, this is interesting, like, they, they are interested in you. And the fact that they, they analyze you not only in a sexual way shows that they are interested in you. <sighs> so, yeah, this has been the reading. Tell me how it resonated, please. <laughs>